Leslie here with another plan with me. We're in my Erin Condren vertical neutral um, and we're doing the week of May 16th through the 22nd. Now today is Wednesday the 18th so usually I go ahead and lay down a few stickers with you but usually I don't write in it um, while I'm planning. I usually do that off camera um, and honestly I haven't been taking a lot of end of the week spread picks. It's been be more before the pin spread week spread picks but I can flip back and show you past spreads um, I'm gonna try to do that more at like the end of each month so that you guys know I'm actually using my planner I guess um, so here's the full boxes from this kit it has things like I'd rather be reading or home is where the herd is is what it says it says herd um, <laughs> and then it says faith family farm and then it says home and there's like a little farm truck I'm gonna focus more on and then it says today today a reader I don't know um, so I know there's like a library here as well but I think I'm gonna focus more on the flowers and like the flower truck and like I guess farm ish elements I don't know but I have these washi tapes picked out because of all the florals that are in it um, I feel like there's more and then I look at it and I'm like no there's not and then I'm like yes there is so I go back and forth on that one but let's go ahead and get started um, this is a pansy that goes in the shop on Friday so that's exciting we have our floral bow with gold accents I do have a yellow truck not a pink truck so I grabbed my yellow truck and then this flower seemed to like match really well it's the light pink one and then I have my floral coffee cup then a new pink rosebud and then the rosebud bow which is really fun so Let's go ahead and get started. I think I'm gonna, I'm trying to decide if I wanna do um, the bottom washi or not. I'm thinking no, cause I don't want that much gold in the spread um, because I might be mixing some, what do you call it, metals, foils. Um, cause there's silver on here and I might use the purple. So I'm probably gonna not use the washi, but that's my reason, <laughs> if that helps. Um, okay, and then we do have some long full box stickers of the girls there's like extra ones and then there's long full boxes of those flowers so I might use that here and there because I don't like I said I'm probably I don't want this so I don't think I want the library thing or that I'd rather be reading I'm not sure I don't know I don't know I'm gonna say that and then you guys know I'm gonna end up doing it so it's whatever <laughs> okay let's go ahead and get started um, I think I want Let's see, what sticker do I want first? I don't know. We'll go with this one. I'd rather be reading, which is the reading one. But it's like a little chair. I used to have a chair like this. Um, I don't anymore. I don't remember. Like, we didn't, like, purposely get rid of it. It just kind of, like, it was actually a hand-me-down chair that my parents got. And then it was a hand-me-down chair from them to us. So then we slowly just kind of, like, went away from it <laughs> is what ended up happening. Okay, I'm going to have these girls, I think, on this side. And then we'll see about... Um, yeah, I think I want that about there. We're going to throw in some washi tape. I have lots of washi, so not really worried about having excess space. And then we'll put this girl not on that side. That's not going to work for me. There's, like, books on this one. I guess we'll go with, like, the fireplace. This will have more of, like, the scene over here, I guess. I'm going to raise it up just a little bit. I'm just trying to cover up the lines at the bottom. Okay, so the big thing that we've been working on besides like updates on our house and stuff like that, <laughs> um, which kind of coordinates in with working on, um, probably going to put a washi tape up there this time. We're trying to get ready for my son's birthday. Um, I can't believe it's here already, <laughs> right? Everybody always says they grow up too fast and when they're babies, you never believe them, but... <laughs> Maybe you do, but I felt like, <laughs> I felt like baby stage was like forever. <laughs> I don't know why. It just felt like it. Um, I enjoyed it, but at the same time I was like, man, I can't wait till he can talk. Like I just remember saying that. So that's what I think of when I think of like when he was a baby. Um, so let's go ahead and put this right here. And then I might have one of the, another girl. Um, but I feel like then she'll be up here. So we should put this one here and we'll grab another girl. Let's see, who do we have and who do we not have? Who do I have so far? This is like an ombre brunette. That's like all brown. I feel like, mm, yeah, they just have her head tilted a different way. So she's already on here, but this one's not on here because that's a different hair and skin tone. Okay. <laughs> well, all the girls. <laughs> We're going to have all the girls. 
Okay, this one is going to go, I think, all the way to the top is what I'm going to end up doing, which I know it matches the header, the background of this does. I was really bouncing around there, wasn't I? Sorry. Um, so I thought I would talk about planning a kid's birthday party. Um, how many of you had have planned a kid's birthday party um, or are going to, and you're like wondering what to do? <laughs> so obviously we had, okay, uh, he wasn't in daycare when he was a little baby, and then kindergarten we did go ahead and do, I think I'm going to put this on the sidebar because I do love this pattern. It's the gold that I was like trying to avoid. So it's not anything against that. So I was wondering if you guys have planned a party recently because obviously when um, everything got shut down, um, his birthday was definitely at home and it was just me and him and his dad and um, my in-laws because they lived across the street at the time. Let's go ahead and put this one on the sidebar. I track the orders every day um, or copy them down later <laughs> as we are doing now. <laughs> so there you go. All right, um, I think I'm gonna go with full box checklist because these are outlined in gold. I think that's why. And then there's like gold extra, ex extra elements there. And then I like the half boxes. It's just a tiny amount of gold on those ones. So I think we'll keep those around. See, there's more floral on this one. Yeah, and then it says like our farm, which is cute. So I've also been planting a lot of flowers, so I thought that would be fun to use. Okay, let's go ahead and sticker down our full boxes to make sure we have room for these full box checklists. So the big thing was like deciding on um, the theme. So <laughs> I do um, order a lot from uh, Party City whenever I or order, I go shopping there. Um, when I'm planning my son's birthday, I don't know if you guys have a party city, but what's your go-to party, um, planning store? I would love to know. Cause I have actually planned a party from Dollar Tree as well. They had really good, um, Lego themed items actually compared to party city. So there are times that like I will use, um, Dollar Tree. Also they have cheaper balloons. So <laughs> like, like to get them inflated and stuff, way cheaper. If you're on like, you know, you're trying to make sure that you're watching your money. Um, which I feel like we all are right now. So, and then we were trying to decide where. He's had a birthday party at a pizza place before. Um, that was with some family friends. It was at Pizza Hut and it, they had like a back room that was kind of separate. Um, so we've done that before. And then he was considering Urban Air. I don't know if you guys have one where you live, um, but it's kind of like a well, it's a place where kids can go and jump and act crazy and there's like zip line, but I know that each urban air has a few different um, things that they offer. So I know it's not the same everywhere. Um, so I'm not gonna pretend that it is <laughs> in case you're like, mine doesn't have that. I don't know. Um, like I saw online, some of them have like the go-kart racing. Ours doesn't have that, but I think ours has like, uh, like a zip line or something like that. So I don't know. Okay, should I go all the way down with this one? Yeah, I think so. We'll go this far. I'll mix it up on how far I went down. There we go. Um, so we thought about that one, and his friends have done Urban Air. The thing about Urban Air is I feel like the, it's such a big space. One, it will be hard for me as a parent to, like, keep track of where all the little kiddos are. And then um, I was also thinking that the kids don't really, like, always play together. Like, you want to have 10 kids because if you want the private room, it's for 10 kids. So you want to invite 10 kids, but then these 10 kids aren't necessarily going to play with each other, let alone the birthday kid. Like he's been to two parties and I feel like both times he didn't really play that much with the birthday person. So I was like, eh, not really liking that. And then the other option was like, um, a little like, um, golf putt putt place. Problem with that is it might be way too hot by then. Um, not sure. So we kind of need to be able to have like indoor outdoor kind of activities. And so I wasn't sure about that one. We even looked at like a rock climbing place, but then we were like, not every kid is like super active or is not afraid of heights. And so I was like, maybe that's not a good idea. I don't know. Plus we've never actually like, besides the rock climbing wall at his playground. And I think at a uh, like random, like public, um, playground, he hasn't really like done rock climbing. So I don't know. Um, so we ended up deciding on doing it at our house. <laughs> so, but our house is not like, 
completely ready. Like we've been doing little projects here and there, but there's always like, oh, this house hasn't been lived in a while. We have to vacuum out the, um, what do you call that stuff that's under the house? Like the vents or whatever. So we had to, or okay, my husband had to, <laughs> let's correct that. Um, had to vacuum that out. I'm going to put headers in the header spot there. Um, and so it's just like things like that kind of slow you down on other like project ideas that you may have for your home. And so I feel like that's kind of what we've been running into here and there. So we've decided that it was going to be then. And then his birthday is during the week. So then we were trying to decide if it was going to be the weekend before or the weekend after. I think I'm going to do washi tape above this one. So we'll put that closer together. I'm going to do headers after. Don't panic. Don't panic. We will have our heading. <laughs> okay, this one maybe this way just to mix it up. I want to put washi tape underneath it. And then probably going to have some washi tape above it. Probably. There's no more half boxes on this sheet. Why are you looking at that? Um, so then we're looking at that. Now, my dad is going to be having his first knee surgery on, I'm trying to decide if I want it closer. I think I want it up here because I'm going to put some washi tape right here. So I don't know why I started whispering. I might put washi tape up here because <laughs> it was a thought <laughs> more than a statement. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I got quiet. What can I say? Okay, do I go all the way down, stagger it up, put washi tape? I think washi. I think we'll put washi down there. Just completely mix this up. I don't want to line it up with that. That's not too lined up. Okay, good on that. All right, we got some purple here. That will go well. Okay, should I do this and put washi here? I think that would be good. Let's do that. Okay. Um, so we decided, so my, my dad's going to have knee surgery like the day before his birthday. So I think they told me that they wanted to celebrate with him before that happens. So, okay, I kind of like the purple more than the peach color. So I'm going to go with the mini things, <laughs> even though it's what I post on Instagram. So it's fine. <laughs> it can be whatever I want. I just think headers look cute. <laughs> do you pick it based on color? Or are you like, no, it has to be to do in today? I don't know. I, I get a little like, but I like this color better. I don't know. I feel like for my to do, I like to do. But then at the same time, it's like if I was doing today, that's fine too. I don't know. Or if it's like many things or M-A-N-Y, many, many things. <laughs> Not many, many. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. So anyway, so I think we're leaning towards, and then we also wanted a little bit more time to like get um, the house ready, the backyard ready and stuff. Um, so I was like, okay, let's do it the weekend after. Um, he's like, so I'll already be nine. And I was like, yeah, you'll already be nine, <laughs> but we'll go ahead and celebrate like with your friends and stuff. And he was like, okay. So, oh, I didn't say what our theme was. We landed on gaming. <laughs> That's what I, I just realized I was like skipping around. Um, so I picked from the themes that are on the like party city website. Cause then I could just show it to him from home instead of like walking around the store knowing I'm not really ready to like buy things just yet like it's a little early um I usually buy things closer to the party because then I know how many kids are gonna like be there um that sort of thing so we um we decided on the weekend after so that'll give us a little bit more time and then then all the like what's like what are we doing what are we gonna eat all of that stuff kind of like started piling in on like um okay you got to make some decisions all right we have to make some decisions on washi tape actually <laughs> as well. I have to make some decisions. Okay. I feel like I'm going to need to color in all of these, um, because I'm looking at my washi tape choices and most of them are pretty transparent. I'm not going to do like the best job at coloring these cause I'm not trying to be too picky <laughs> cause I want to hurry, <laughs> but I plan on probably putting washi tape in every spot that there is a line, because I usually just don't like the lines. If Erin Condren made a planner where it didn't have lines, I would probably complain that it didn't have lines, because that's the kind of person I am. But, because some of, some of the lines I did use, I put the stickers with the line, but I don't like them just floating around like this. So, I tend to want to cover them up. And I like this um, Uniball Signo pen. I have it in the description box below if you 
want to order it on Amazon. It's an affiliate link. I'm not going to lie to you. It's an affiliate link. I always tell you. No hidden secrets here. So, um, so we decided he wanted to serve pizza, which I think the last party he was at, um, they, I don't think they ate food because it was at a different time. It wasn't at like a meal time. So we were like, okay, do we want to do lunchtime or dinner time? And so we decided lunchtime would be better, like middle of the day on a Saturday, um, would be the better option for probably most people. I don't know. Um, and then I was like, all right. And then we were looking at like, how long do we want the party to be? So how long do you think a kid's party should be? Cause a lot of the ones that we've been to lately are like just two hours and that I feel like it goes by so fast. Okay. I'm not going to white out all those lines down there. I'm just going to white out this darker one. Um, but I feel like two hours goes by really fast. And I was like, if he's going to eat and he decided on cupcakes, it was cake versus cupcake and he decided on cupcakes. Um, and then, so I'm like, if they're going to do pizza cupcakes, like, and playing, the, the plan is for them to play games outside. We were trying to decide if we wanted to do yard games or water games. Um, and I think he decided on yard games because we thought water games, not every kid will like that. I don't necessarily have um, enough squirt guns. I think in the bigger areas, I'm going to try to utilize this washi tape or I might have, like, an awkward amount of space. This is washi tape from... The planner society from a super duper long time ago so and I have planner society videos I don't know if you guys know that um, and all of them are kind of like craft with me videos so I come up with a project I open the box and I come up with a project like right there on the spot sometimes I kind of know because she shares um, she well she used to when the, she had the box she would share sneak peeks of the items so I would kind of have an idea of like what I wanted to make um, or there's like staple items that she would put in the box. So if you're interested in crafty videos, I do have those in a playlist. Anyway, so <laughs> a little shameless plug there, I guess. It made me think of it, honestly. That's all. <laughs> okay, this is a little bit of purple, and I like it. They kind of look like butterflies, but they're flowers. That one looks like a butterfly, but they're flowers. And I think they would be good in tiny little spots like this. So I'm going to put some in. I also have another two skinny washies. One, I'm not sure if it's black or if it's dark blue. I'm just not sure. I'm not sure. Um, and then for the cake versus cupcake, um, he actually also, we were looking at the home like cake toppers and he actually wants me to make them, which I started thinking that like my planner clips would actually be the stuff I make on the top would actually be really cute as a cupcake topper. So I'm considering starting to sell those. Um, they'll kind of be sold on an individual basis unless you message me. And so it'll be kind of like a listing option. Um, unless you message me and you want like a bunch of them. Cause then obviously I might be able to do more of like a discount if I'm making a bunch of the same thing. So I'm thinking about launching cake toppers. So let me know if that's a thing that you guys would be like, yeah, I would probably be interested in that. That'd be great. So this one's purple. I feel like I need a blue. So then I'm between these ones. Okay, this skinny one we can fit here and there. Um, so is this blue like a really dark blue or is it black? Because I don't think I've ever used it. What color is this? Oh, don't put it on the white out. Okay, that looks black to me. Okay, I'm going to say that's probably black. It's a really pretty washi. I just feel like I've struggled to use it my whole life. <laughs> my whole planner life. <laughs> the last seven years. I don't know how long I've had that. I'm joking. <laughs> I have no idea. Okay, I think this up here. We'll put this up here. Now, there is some deco stickers, so I'm going to leave some space. I'm going to leave some space for that. We will be incorporating those, I think. Um, so we decided we would do a three-hour party, which I think basically the second half, they might switch to more indoor games, like on... Um, the Nintendo Switch and that kind of thing. So that will be a fun little change. See, I'm thinking I need the watering can washi down here. This doesn't perfectly match that. So it needs to be over here, I think. Yeah. I think that's where I want it. And then I need to grab the watering can washi again. 
and put it over there. Put it over there. All right, I need to take a drink. You guys take a drink too. I'm using my polka dotty cup today. Man, I was really thirsty, sorry. <laughs> I'm drinking water, I'm drinking water. It was, it's been very warm actually. Not like super hot, but I think we've had a couple of air conditioning days, just a couple, just a couple. Um, so we might do like once they eat and presents, unwrapping presents will probably be inside. Then we might switch to um, switch games or a movie. I don't know, I'll just let it go. Like they can pick, I don't care. <laughs> it's kind of like just a big fun hangout with his buddies. So, um, so far he did, we also, um, he came up with six kids that he said he would really like to spend the day with. Okay. I'm kind of thinking the pink, this peachy pink, this might be good. As long as it's not like right next to the other one, then I think it'll be fine. So a chunk of this here would be perfect. I think this is an American crafts washi that I ordered online actually a super long time ago. So I don't know if you can still get it. I'm not sure. That one kind of tore funny. It's fine. That's what deco's for. Okay. So do I put deco here or washi tape? It is a full box and I do need this on both sides at some point. And I don't have a theme sticker though up here. So I'm not sure what I plan on doing about that. I'm not sure. I didn't decide. Oh, should I put another one of these, but just like shorten it? I could. Oh, I need a header. Oh no, I put, goodness, goodness. Okay, so this week's sticker, what am I gonna put over there? This week's new releases, like I always do. I don't know why I do the things I do. I'm not sure, I'm not sure. Cause I talk and plan at the same time, that's why. <laughs> that's probably why. So I think we decided that 11, to two would be good. Um, like 11 to 12 playing outside, you know, before the like sun is really all the way at the top. Um, in case it is really warm, glitter washi would have been a nice option too. I've, I've incorporated that <laughs> with my double headers. Okay. So once again, I'm going to focus, I almost grabbed the books. I'm going to focus more on the flowers, um, and trying to incorporate more of those in the spaces that I have left. Um, yeah. Okay. That one's already kind of on there. Um, where do I want this one? It's kind of big. I didn't leave a lot of space. I thought I would have more space, but I kind of don't. So we'll just stick that there. And then this purple one will go up here. This blue one. I didn't want the pink one because there's a pink one right there. So that didn't make any sense to me on having it there. Okay. Let's put this one here. And then we'll grab this floral over here. So I have some of the book elements in this spread, but not a ton. I'm trying to bring out the floral aspect. So I think I'm going to leave those behind, which means they're going to the de-stash pile. So make sure you let me know if you want those um, when you order from my shop, because I'll just throw them in your order. <laughs> you just let me know. You just let me know. Um, and then I have this other long full box as well. So let's go ahead and put in some of my functional stickers, I think, from my sticker pocket, from mine. Um, what else? We decided on the time. Oh, yeah, and then the invitations. So that one was a fun thing. Um, so this week, when did we finally get listing photos done? Yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. Listing photos got done yesterday. And then I have had to go to the post office every day. <laughs> I have to go every day. So thank you guys so much for ordering. Super awesome. Okay. So we'll do these mailbox ones from vintage lilac paper. They got little kawaii faces on them and everything. Little kawaii faces. Um, new release stickers from planning in blue jeans. We'll grab this like dark blue one. New releases go in the shop on Fridays. Put that one in. Um, organized stickers every day of my life. Payday Etsy pays on Tuesdays. So we can put that in. This one's from Sweet Ava's paper. And then we have a TGIF sticker, but I don't think it matches, so I'm gonna skip it. Um, new release sticker we already did. Um, cutting, I did some cutting today. I had to restock the Erin Condren tabs. Um, so I'm gonna put cut today. <laughs> and then we already put a payday sticker in. Um, I watch Plan With Me's like every morning when I'm getting ready, but I haven't like sat down and watched a ton of them in a while. 
So um, this one looks like planning time. So a plan with me goes up on Thursdays. And um, I haven't done sticker hauls in a while. Post office, I go every day. I was trying to put this. I don't know that this one was letting me have it. Yeah, it is. Okay. I put this over in new releases because I do make bow clips. Oh, here's another planner. Okay, this one looks like a planner unboxing video. And that went up on Wednesday. My teacher planner um, arrived. So I have that one. And then we have the other plan with me on Saturdays. The happy planner one. And then I worked on listings actually today. I did not get them completely finished yet, but I will. I'll get it done eventually. Wednesday, washy Wednesday. Hardly ever do it. Always have the sticker. And then a new releases sticker. I think I'm good. I got the bow there. I think it's alright. I did already do a plan with me. I did mailing. I did a new release sticker. Um, YouTube, I caught up on replying to comments today. So thank you guys so much for leaving comments. I love reading your comments and stories. Um, I'm filming today. And I filmed yesterday. <laughs> and I filmed on Monday. <laughs> it's been a very busy filming week. Because I filmed the new releases video then. Then I filmed the boxing then. And then I'm filming and playing with me tonight. So lots of filming. Um, this is for cutting and designing. So I'm, I haven't started on like the next next new releases yet. That hasn't happened. Has not happened. So there you go. That's kind of how I plan. Um, and then I kind of write in next to things, like I'll write the word listing photos or mail orders, or like if I got happy mail from Planner Sister Stickers, <laughs> they send me happy mail to my P.O. box. So then I write that in. So um, I don't really do um, unboxings anymore. Um, I haven't in a while, but I like this one. I'm going to use it. I forgot about it. I said I was going to use it because I was like, oh, this one's super skinny. It can go anywhere. And then I forgot to include it. So I'm doing it now. <laughs> I'm doing it now. But I want the word memories. That looks so cute. Oh, I kind of did the same thing. I feel like I made an additional full box out of this washi and the watering can washi. Also, watering my flowers with my watering, watering can is literally one of my favorite things. So there you go. I would love to know about your um, party planning stuff. The other thing we did is we designed our um, own invitations. And by we, I mean my husband um, used Photoshop and he made the invitations because it's kind of all about digital invitations now because you kind of like just text people the invites, um, which I really like because then you get feedback right away usually um, if people are going to be able to make it or not. So I kind of like that instead of waiting and like seeing if they got it in the mail and things like that. So I think I'm going to use the little new tiny flower because it's so cute. Um, so it's a, like a switch and then it has a Minecraft background and then he used like a gaming font. I don't have room for this one. Um, and so that was really awesome. I told him, I was like, you know, people would probably want to buy that off of you. So I don't know. <laughs> um, but yeah, so he did that for our son and he loved it. So, and we got some compliments on it when I was texting it to people. So I would show you, but obviously it has all like super personal information on it. <laughs> so maybe I'll try to block that out and share it. I don't know. <laughs> so there you go. That is my spread for the week of May 16th through the 22nd. I would love to hear your kid birthday planning stories, or if you had a kid birthday when you were little that you really loved, I would love to know those stories. So leave those in the comments and I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for stopping by. Bye.